Back, everybody. They are genetic marvels to many who see them. Two cloned dogs living right here in Lafayette. Thanks to a lab in South Korea, they are two of only 400 in the world right now. This procedure is not allowed here in the U.S. because of ethical and humane concerns. But for at least one owner, the idea of cloning a pet isn't controversial. As an area vet tells our Carrie Beal, it's just a way to extend the years of man's best friend. Meet Ken and Henry. They are two clones of their genetic replica, Melvin. He's very smart. I had other dogs, but he's been one of the smartest ones I ever had. And that's just one of the reasons Lafayette veterinarian Arthur DuPont had his dog cloned. The only noticeable difference between these three dogs is that this middle one doesn't have a white strip down its nose. So some of these dogs might be different a little bit on the outside, but on the inside, they're all genetically the same. That's the only thing the surrogate mother has effect on is this. The spot. DuPont only planned on having one dog, but to their lucky surprise, the surrogate mother bore another. They thought she was pregnant for one, him, but I mean, she was uncomfortable in, in the next two days, and they went in, did open up the uterus, and found Hen Henry. Some have questioned what happens to the surrogate mothers once their work is done, but as a consultant for the cloning company, Sue Ann Biotech, DuPont confirms the mothers are treated as pets. And they're given back to families afterwards. Oh no, they're very careful with that. From their bark to the way these dogs sneeze. Good dog. Good dog. DuPont says he sees a piece of his Melvin in each one of them. They act the same. They, they, they have the same personality and everything else. DuPont said he's so happy with his decision, he may have another clone when the puppies grow old. In Lafayette, Carrie Beal, KGC, TV3. The cloning company, Suam Biotech, calls also clones dogs with special skills. Those dogs are used by law enforcement officials and as companions for people with special needs. Stay with us, everyone. More news coming up right after this break.